Gizzy bug. Get on the gizzy bug. His body so I can see that. A little gizzy, huh? A little gizzy. Nice. Good. I got good luck standing next to me. <laughs> <laughs> He's just been reeling them in left and right. Yeah, about time. Want to get this nice. on? Got another double? <laughs> yeah. How is he? He's a nice fish. Yeah. He doesn't want to come up out of the hole though. Long one, isn't it? Yeah, it's a good long one. Not real fat like a lot of them are. Just down, but <clears throat> seen them on the camera. And old Adam was coaching me. Seen him grab it and took a second to before I seen my spring bobber dip. And as soon as it dipped down, I I nailed him. We had him. That's fun, isn't it? Oh yeah, that's fun. It's just like having a video game down there. Watch those. <laughs> Watch all the action. There's James got one now. Yeah, you are good luck. <laughs> Whoa. That's a feisty one there. Nice. Nice one. There you go. Strawberry's all about, isn't it? Yeah, big That's fish. That's a nice cutthroat. Another one on the ice cutter. White and red flake. They just think they need to be doing in there. Now it's done. Right there. What do you got, Tim? What's working right now? Uh, that one and a half inch ice cutter uh, in white with red flake. A little piece of chub meat on it or a mealworm on a 16th ounce head. Down about how deep, James? I think it's 19 foot here. I forgot my fish finder, but I think Brian said it was 19. <laughs> I'm having a hard time without my fish finder. That's the lure right there. It has a little uh, glowing uh, pink head. Get him back in there. A little movement seems to be key. Yeah, they want it moving. If you have it just sitting there, they don't seem to want it dead sticking it. So just shake it up and down, just just slowly and move it maybe an inch. So a little bit of movement goes a long ways today. I think it's uh, I think they're seeing it from quite a ways off, seeing it, seeing the movement, and they come over and suck it in. It's not too bad. Nice. Alright. Watching he's got doubles going on and there's a nice rainbow. Got a bow? Yeah. What do you think of that, huh? A little coaching? There he is, there he is! That was fun. Watch that on the camera. So you can you know you throw have to throw most of the cutthroats back, but you can keep four of these rainbows, so it's an opportunity to, you know, take a limit of fish home without killing off the cutthroats you know it's a and they're good eating usually they're good pink meat they're I'm gonna keep this one for the wife she loves the trout so we're gonna take this one home <laughs> she ought to be happy with that oh that's a decent cutthroat Hard to beat, isn't it? Say. Another 19, 20 incher. Put her back. Almost had doubles. It was pretty close to doubles. What color you got on? Well, this one, this color is called, it's 
special blend if I can find it in there. Took it kind of deep. Nice. Another one, huh? Yeah. That's good fish. You want to get this in Taking line, huh? Sucking drag is what we'd like to hear. Nice. How many is that, Jason? Uh, I hate to say it, that's my first one. That's all right. Good fish. <laughs> Long this swim off. Wow. Nice fish, buddy. How do you hit? Really soft. Really soft? Yeah. Alright, let's get it out and put him back in. I think he's uh he's in the slot, so we're gonna have to put him back. Hey, what's the slot? It's pretty nice. Good fish. Good fish. Nice what do you think? It's a lot of fun. <laughs> Let him regain himself. Demo of how fast one of these goes up. Looking back and forth. Nice, good job, buddy. Yeah. First fish off the strawberry this year, huh? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's the second doubles in the row. Hey James, will you help me get that other fish off? Get it back in the water. Yeah. Isn't it a bummer when you're catching so many you gotta have your buddy come help you? <laughs> your brother come help you into it. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I don't mind it. Nice color. That was oh, hooked, beautiful. I hooked him good too. He really ate it. Oh, oh, oh. There you go, Brian. Nice little fish. Yeah. Hold nice on double, to him. Huh? Yeah, everybody get him back in the double. water before I mow him to death. Double on the ice cutter. There, I don't think he's going to go down like that. No, he won't. Awesome. Right. Jigging it, guys. Give it a jig. A chunky little bass. James Bradshaw of Maniac Custom Lures is fishing with good friends Adrian Alexander and Jared Story. We're cruising the rocky points, targeting the monster smallmouth that Jordan L is famous for. Well, they're, they're staging, getting ready for the spawn. They're coming up and starting to feed. And we should be able to get them as they're, as they're moving up into this warmer water. Not bad, he's probably 13, 14 inches, pound and a half. Jared picked up this fish on a Maniac black and white salt stick, but I found this little minnow to be the best bet today. Oh, that's he's a good him. fish, look at that pig. That's a Here nice one. Go. Another minnow. Jim, oh, just color? barely had him. Good job. What color? Yeah, the white you know, I forget. Blue <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's throw another one on. Look at that. Nice smallie. Nice smallie on a maniac minnow. Lunker smallmouth aren't the only trophy fish here at Jordanelle. 